we're setting up an oceanic bow cube for salt water. I just want to show you something um, that's very inexpensive that you can use. They are uh, test strips which measure six tests in one. It's from a company called Jungle. It can be available at most aquarium shops. You don't have to do a lot of mixing of uh, reagents or chemicals to do these tests. And it's it's great if you're just keeping fish, maybe not so much corals, because corals you want to look at other parameters. But you have these test strips that you actually dip into the water and hold it in the water for 10 seconds. And then you pull them out, hold it like this, and you compare. Inside you have... Uh, have your different uh, comparisons. Uh, one is your nitrates, the other is your nitrites. They'll give you a rough reading on that. Also it'll measure your uh, alkalinity of your salt water and your pH of your salt water. So you want to make sure you're holding the, the, the strips as it, according to the instructions. And it's just a very general indicator of your uh, water parameters besides temperature and salinity that you want to pay attention to. If you're again if you're if if you are uh, raising corals you want to be a little bit more particular and um, you want to um, actually have a more accurate test kit that has reagents and you mix them and you take water samples. I'm going to show you very quickly how to do it. You basically take your test strip you just hold it in the water for about 10 seconds and then you actually take it off you compare it to your the chart now again the, it's not very accurate reading but it's rough enough that you can uh, uh, know if something's major or minor is happening in your tank so it's about ready to pull out now you would pull it out and to the light it's a little bit difficult to read but you basically compare it to the uh, the colors to the measurement on your chart and uh, you just do a comparison and you read it yourself so all the parameters here look pretty good um, my nitrates are within the okay range at the lower end my nitrites are extremely safe then there's uh, two bars that are not four a salt water measurement in the middle and then the last two bars uh, one is ideal that's the measure for alkalinity and then the pH is pretty much ideal as well if you look at the color it's hard to get it on the camera but that's how you take the measurement and that's just a simple water test that you can do with this product which I find is very handy again you want to have a proper test kit which costs much more money but while you're waiting for your tank to cycle and just set up, you can use something like this, which is very inexpensive.